Hey everyone, welcome back to Tip of the Week. In this week's video, we're going to talk about head swaps, and I'm going to show you a quick way that you can do it inside On One Photo Raw 2019. So let's talk about head swaps real quick. And if you're not familiar with portrait photography, you may have never even heard of a head swap before. But basically, when you're shooting groups of people or multiple people, they may not all be looking at the camera at the same time, or they may have different expressions in separate images. So a head swap is basically going in here, taking the expression from one photo and putting it onto the other. So I have these two different group photos here that were shot by Bliss Studio out of Portland, Oregon. And let's go in here and I'll grab both these shots and let's head down to compare view mode. And I'm gonna make sure I have lock pan and zoom selected and I'm just gonna zoom in here real quick. So looking at these two different photos, obviously we probably don't want this expression. So what we could do here is we could take this expression and we could put it on this photo here. And then we have this great photo expression right there and she's also looking at the camera. So there's not really a difference between these two. And also I really like this expression more than this one. So let's grab these two photos here and let's put this expression over here. So I know I have both of them selected so I'm just gonna head over and select layers. So now we have these two different photos as layers here. And let's rename this first one correct expression, and we'll rename this other one bad expression. So what I like to do when I do head swaps is I take the correct expression and I put it below the bad expression, and then I mask out the bad expression to reveal the correct one. So let's grab our correct expression here. We'll drag it below our bad one. So now we have the bad one on top. So now we need to align these two layers so that we mask it out correctly. So let's select that bad expression layer. And a quick way that I like to align the layers is I'll go down to my gear icon here for this layer, select it, and I'll go down to the blending mode difference. So with this difference blending mode enabled, this is going to show me the difference between the two photos that I have on top of each other. So if I hit V on my keyboard, watch as I drag this around, and the more I align it with the layer below it, the more it removes all of the different colors that are showing me the difference. So this is a really quick way that you can align your photos whenever you want to mask out a different expression. So now that we have them aligned, I'll go over to the bad expression, and I'll click the gear icon, and then I'll click normal again. So now we need to mask out the bad expression to reveal the correct one. So I'll just grab my masking brush by hitting B on my keyboard. And I see I have a minus sign in there already. So just make sure that you have your mode set to paint out. And also I would recommend having your feather at around 70 to 100, just so you have a nice soft brush edge. So it doesn't leave any hard edges and it blends more realistically. Also definitely have your opacity at 100 so you're removing 100% of the bad expression. So once you have all those settings modified, just head down and we can just brush out the bad expression from the good one. There we go. So now if we head over to that layer and we turn this off and on. We're keeping this good expression and also keeping these other two expressions with it that we wanted to keep in the first place. So now what we can do is I can just hit C on my keyboard and I can crop it to a nice four by five. There we go. So let's do that one more time real quick. So inside Photo Raw, I have these two different group photos as layers. And if I turn off this top layer, I can see that I have both of them looking at the camera while she's actually looking away. 
Well, if I turn on this top expression, I can see that she's looking right at the camera now. So we can use this expression, and we can put it on top of the bad one. So let's grab that bad expression layer again. We'll drag that on top. So now we can mask out the bad expression and replace it with the good one. So we'll make sure we have the bad expression layer selected. We'll use our gear icon, head down to difference, I'll hit V on my keyboard to grab my move tool, and I'll just move this around to align it with the correct expression layer. And again, the more darkness and less color, the more you have it aligned. And you can always use your arrow keys on your keyboard to help you. Perfect. So now we'll go to bad expression, gear icon, and we'll select normal again. Now I can just hit B on my keyboard, make sure my masking brush is set to paint out, feathering at 100, opacity at 100, and I'll just brush the expression that I want in. Perfect. So now if I turn this layer off and on, I get all the expressions I'm looking for so that they're all looking directly at the camera. So that's how to do a quick head swap inside On One Photo Raw 2019. I'm Dylan with On One and stay tuned for more.